guys, we're back for 19.5, the last week of the Open here at CrossFit High Gear with Tom Carroll's head coach down here. He's going to introduce the workout, and we're going to go through the usual warm-up mobility and then come back to Tom for some tips at the end. Sure. So here we go, guys. 19.5, I think it's the cherry on the top here for our 2019 Open. Um, probably a little bit more reps than we had predicted here. So we have 105 reps of two movements here. Um, so we have 33, 27, 21, 15, and 9 of thrusters. For men, it's 95, women, 65, and then we have chest-to-bar pull-ups. So for our warm-up for this, we got to really warm up the pulling movement, and we got to warm up all the squat patterns for all these thrusters. So for our mobility, we're going to hit two rounds of our squat with thoracic rotation. We're going to do five of our yoga push-ups to get the shoulders open, and then we're going to do a counterbalance squat for five reps, and we're going to go through two rounds of that. After that, we'll hit our, work, our warm up. We're gonna hop on that bike for three minutes. In each minute, you're gonna increase that intensity to get the heart rate up before all these reps of thrusters and chest to bars. After that, we're gonna warm up our thrusters. So we're gonna do five one arm thrusters on each side. We're gonna do five kip swings on the bar into five kipping pull ups, and then 10 hollow rocks to finish off to get that core for all the kipping that you're gonna to have to do on these chest to bars. So all right, so Mitch is gonna run through these warm ups. First, we're gonna go through those thoracic or squat with thoracic rotation so he's going to squat down for us elbows are going to be inside the knees and he's going to rotate towards the ceiling and then back down he's going to get that mid back open for all this overhead work and these thrusters good after that he's going to come into a plank position kind of tall push-up we're going to do five yoga push-ups so he's going to go all the way down and then drive straight back hips in the air good get the shoulders nice and active come back down good and then push all the way back up. So you can come down, good, and then drive back up. Perfect. And relax. So then we're going to finish with that counterbalance squat. So he's going to hold a plate, keep his chest up nice and high. He's going to sit back. We're going to hold the bottom of this for three seconds on each rep. So we're going to do five of them with a three second hold. All the way down, chest nice and tall. Get deep into that squat position. All right, so the warm up, you're going to start again on that bike for three minutes. You're going to increase intensity each minute and you should be breathing pretty heavy when you get off of that. From there, we're gonna go into three rounds of one arm thrusters, five kip swings, five pull ups, and then 10 hollow rocks. So he's gonna demonstrate a single arm thruster. So we're going single arm front rack position, all the way full depth, and then press at the top. From there, you're gonna hop onto the bar. We're gonna do kip swings. So a nice arch hollow position, and then straight into your pull ups. Good, and you're gonna do five reps of each of those. He's gonna drop down on the ground and give me 10 hollow rocks. So again, nice arch position, and we're just gonna rock and roll back and forth, keeping that nice hollow shape. All right, now that you're all good and warmed up, loosened up for this workout, let's go over some tips. Break it up. I know it sounds really obvious, but you should probably even break it up more than you think, um, especially in those early rounds, getting through that 33, 27. Um, even if you're like a sub three Fran type of athlete, um, probably still even break that up even more than you think you should. You can always come back to the bar and do more. What you don't want to do is burn out early. Um, then also I said push your later sets. You know, when you get to these smaller sets that we're familiar with, 15 and 9, maybe try to go for those rounds unbroken if you feel like you can do it. Yeah. All right, guys, so that's it for 19.5. Good luck on the last week of the Open, and we'll see you next year. Let's do it.